It's fair to say that there are several businesses out there that are worried about their futures because of the changes to the minimum wage and other employment standards that were ushered in along with it. But while Tim Hortons and Sunset Grill franchisees were being blasted on social media last week, Oakville business owner Jeff Knoll was being lauded for his own internal memo that went viral over the weekend. Apparently somebody felt that uh, they needed to leak it to the public and, and that's how uh, this letter got out into the public domain, I think predominantly on social media. And it's been a bit of a surprise to me that I'm getting phone calls and, and uh, questions from the media uh, about this because originally it was intended to be something that we just simply kept in-house. Uh, our intention was to announce our decision around price increases later this week, which we will be doing. Uh, so this is sort of the cat out of the bag that uh, we will not be increasing our mission prices, at least for the time being for 2018. We're going to see how that works out for us. Noel felt that it was important to reassure his employees and let them know that they had his full support when it boils down to it. His business is nothing without them. Like most businesses, uh, initially we were uh, very concerned. Uh, I still have some reservations that it's happening so rapidly. I have no objection to the concept of moving uh, the minimum wage up. Um, I just a uh, little bit of a concern in, the, in terms of how quickly it's going to happen. But initially, as I said, we, we had concerns how we're going to cope with this thing. We spent a lot of time really analyzing uh, uh, you know, our costs and uh, the, cost from the, you know, the additional costs for the employees. But what we really came to the conclusion of was that, that our business really is our employees. I mean, our films are obviously very important, but the thing that sets us apart from our competition is our guest services and, and what we offer to uh, our very valuable guests that come in this business. And their first point of contact is always our staff. Perhaps it shouldn't be a surprise that Noel has seen an increase in recognition by his social media. He has already been at the forefront of YouTube advertising here in the region for some time now. And he believes that creativity and the entrepreneurial spirit will be what sets businesses apart in this new age. We're very fortunate that our business is already on an upward trajectory. We've done some terrific marketing over the past year. We have terrific uh, uh, support from our community and as a result we felt we had the revenue to be able to uh, offset this without uh, jeopardizing our business. Not all businesses have that ability and so uh, you know I think that that's where their, their nervousness happens. But with creativity and going out and reaching out into their communities and uh, using uh, good old entrepreneurial ingenuity, I think that many businesses can weather the storm. Now, Noel did say that his business will need to attract 9,000 additional customers over the next year to recoup the revenue discrepancy incurred by these changes. Reporting for Halton News, I'm Pierce Lang.